The Salton Sea, Olivia Sandusky has been doing a great job covering it in length with her special reports. But what was it before the sea flooded in? Evan Lovett tells us the tale of the Salton Sink in this desert in a minute. What is up this year? LA in a minute. And do you know that at one point there was so much salt being mined in the Southern California deserts that it was referred to as California white gold? That's right. In fact, how do you think the salt didn't see got its name? Let's get into it. For millions of years, what would become known as the Colorado River flowed into the Imperial and Coachella Valleys, depositing alluvium, which is a type of soil that includes minerals, including salt. As the river alternately flowed into the valley or diverted around it through the millennia, it created a salt lake called Lake Coahuila. Over the centuries, a concentration of salt was deposited on approximately 1,000 acres of dry seabed from seepage in the salt springs in the foothills. And that's when George Dubrow had the idea to harvest this salt. In 1883, Dubrow and investors incorporated the new Liverpool Salt Company at Salton on the Southern Pacific Railroad main line. Now, technically, it's called salt mining, but it was more like salt harvesting. There was so much salt on this dry lake bed. All they needed to do was collect, crush, and bag the salt and send it along the railroad. The laborers were mostly Native Americans and Japanese immigrants, and they harvested over 700 tons of pure salt per day. The salt was replenished almost as fast as it could be harvested, as any time water flowed into the basin, it would quickly evaporate and left deposits of very pure salt that were up to 20 inches in thickness. In February of 1891, the Colorado River overflowed and reached the Salton Basin, which created a lake 30 miles long and 10 miles wide. But it was only five feet deep, and being so shallow, it evaporated and left the salt works intact. There was so much salt in the Southern California deserts that it became the major supplier for the state of California and the West Coast, and was considered white gold in the area. In fact, that's why the area is called the Salton Sea, but before that, it was even known as the Salton Sink. However, in 1905, the salt dreams of the Imperial and Coachella Valleys ended as the Colorado River flooded the Salton Basin and created the Salton Sea. The salt field was submerged, then the salt plant, and then the entire town of Salton and the rail lines. So before it was the Salton Sea, it was the Salton Sink in the Salton Basin, all because of the salt that was California's white gold. All right, LA, it's been a minute. And don't forget, you can catch Evan Lovett at LA in a Minute on social media on Instagram.